Hello, I'm Falag and today we are going to be wiping the floors with aliens. Hey, hi, hello everyone and welcome to another tactical tutorial. Today we are going to be talking about, uh, well, very basic uh, suppression wall tactic that is going to be used by, very often by you in order to keep strong enemies like those two cyber discs at bay and uh, give all your other troops time to deal oh, with them. The important things about this tactics is the use of smoke grenades in order to make it uh, very difficult for the enemies to hit you, suppression to make them unwilling to come closer, and those grenades that you otherwise fuck you in the, in the eyeball, and uh, the pacing of ammunition so that you do not run out of ammo and uh, can suppress them indefinitely. So you will need at least two suppressor, un suppressor units. As you see in the situation, we can't really toss a small grenade because we are too far away. So aye, aye, we will not be able to further damage that un uh, any of those cyber discs this turn, and we must keep them in place so they don't go for a flank, don't toss a grenade at us, and uh, uh, do not in other ways uh, kill us and our families and our dogs. So we are going to be doing it by creating a wall Got of suppressions uh, from different angles so that, that it can't be solved by one of the cyber discs breaking out uh, and tossing a grenade and in the suppressions. We are going to be engaging the drones uh, also in uh, by damaging the cyber discs. The drones are going to do whatever the hell they can in order to uh, fix Happy them. Smoke. If you would be uh, meeting uh, seekers then the seekers are a priority because seekers would do their best to stop the suppression and we must not do allow that. And here I'm just going to uh, in the footage help run for the map. Important. And uh, we are going to do so with the use of our shiv and our gunner, which, which we do actually have on that mission. We also have uh, the medic with the suppression ability, but uh, he is not going to play any part in this tutorial. And here we go. We are going to suppress them both for now, as you see. Our other soldiers are getting in position to effectively fight them in the meantime. And you will see how uh, the combination of smoke grenades with suppression really works on the enemy. So they're not going to shoot. And there you go. This is a very effective tactic just to fight the cyber disc at long range. It's uh, a little less effective against sectopods, and, uh, but it also works pretty well against mectoids and mutonerids. So uh, you are going to be employing that tactic very often. And as you see, the drones are, got, are going, are getting stupid. They don't want to be close because they don't want to be uh, in the uh, direct range, but they want to fix the cyber disk and they don't know what to do. Drones have Windows Vista as the operating system. And in any way, as you see, we have given ourselves the time to toss the grenade in the, to toss the rocket in place and that is going to create everything we really need. So yeah, this is it. As you see, this is a very simple tactic. We use the smoke Suck grenades to make this. the uh, enemies uh, unlikely to hit you. We use the suppressions the to uh, keep them at bay and keep them overwatching while our people are moving into position. Don't worry about the overwatchers because if you suppress the enemy first, then the overwatch is not gonna fire, so we don't have to worry about it. And as you see, this gives us the time to deal with uh, the drones so that they can stop uh, the, uh, fixing our, tar our targets. We can easily, as you see, finish them off and they are practically docile. So this is suppression barrier and I hope that uh, you are going to find this tactic very useful, even as simple as it is. It is extremely efficient. So, thanks for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If so, let me know in the comments, like the video, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and see you again next time. Bye-bye!